up there guys my name is Sarvis and today I am back bringing you something new something awesome you can see right here Tanzia is the new game that I have got right here in front of me it is in closed beta currently but I have got my hands on it and we are going to jump in and see what this game is all about so let's get started her name, Sabrez. It's a great name, I like it. So we'll do that. Alright guys, there we are. We are in it right now. Movement, WASD keys to move. Right mouse button to look around. Interactive NPC monsters, anything else you can interact with. Blow. Okay, find Abenaki. Quest journal. Alright. So here we go, we can look around. There we go, WASD, looking around. Alright, there we go. And uh, let's get started. Happy birthday, Sabrez. I promised your grandfather I'd protect you, but I have to accept that today you are an adult. I will let you leave the village alone soon. All right. But first, your new freedom comes with new responsibility. It is time to perform the annual ritual of the totems to replenish the totem, the totems that shield the village from the forbidden art of voodoo. <laughs> voodoo, I like it. I need your help preparing for it. You'll need a weapon, a spell, and a potion. First, the weapon. Here is one gold. That is a cheap weapon. Go buy me a practice staff, then return to me. Go buy, go buy a practice staff. Alright. Oh, uh oh. Can you hear me, little one? <gasps> Grandpapa. I can hear you, Grandpapa. I'm here. What are we looking for? Okay, that was just weird. Alright, so I guess the uh, dueling swords there is a uh, weapon. Alright, there we go. Practice staff. Got it. Alright, you appear to be in my hand already. Good. Alright, let's go back to Mr. Abenaki over here. Alright, sir. Ah, yes. Good. That's a fine staff to get you. It was a one gold piece staff. What are you talking about? Now, Arcanity. Find the trainer and learn the ice shard spell from him. Two gold. Alright, so this is a little bit better than the staff. Uh, does right, not look like Arcana. That's not it. Is this it? What is this? Who are you? Do you have my spell? You do. Right now, you only have enough gold for Ice Shard. Get more gold. Check. Ice Shard. Got it. Uh, put it on your uh, spell book. There we go. Check. Done. All right. We are rocking and rolling right now. Back to Mr. Abenaki. And click. I see that Arcanity comes easily to you. Just like Mako. Who is Mako? In time, you will be able to thwart even the most sinister voodoo masters. I like that. I'm going to thwart them. I will thwart you all. And finally, there is alchemy. I will teach you that art later. Of course, but for now, just go buy a healing potion. It's not going to guard you against voodoo. Find the alchemist. Purchase healing potion. Three. Oh my gosh. That's more expensive than magic. So apparently... Potions are very expensive. Does it talk to you? No. Be careful out there. Okay. Does it talk to you? Yes. Red potion. Healing. Three gold. Bought it. Got it. Check. Done. I'll put it on my uh, hot bar. Uh, equipment probably. Yes. Perfect. Got it. Return to Abenaki. Alright. Here we go. Ah. Young Sovereigns. Your grandfather Mako. Okay. That's who Mako is. It's, it's Grandpapa. Would be proud if he were alive to see you, but please don't be reckless. You are not yet one of the heroes from our stories. Oh, jeez. Way to knock me down. Take me down a notch. Come on. Its power continues to wane until we perform the ritual, but the big totem in the center of the village will still restore your health and energy when not in combat. When you're away from the village, look for smaller totems and stay close to them. When you need a rest, I mark them on your map for you. Wonderful. First chores, collect Akiri feathers. We'll need quite a lot of them. Search for the birds, blah, blah. 20 feathers. <laughs> it's okay if they're a little bit charred. Uh-oh. Another vision. And although the Akiri birds appeared passive enough, the young hero knew of their ferocious nature. Though still a novice of Arcanity, his fireball was powerful and his staff was strong. He remained calm and stood his ground, swinging and casting as fast as he could, and he prevailed. He gathered their precious feathers, some a little charred, and continued on his task with steadfast resolve. Wonderful! 
but I don't have anything to char you with. Once again, you quickly regain awareness. Alright. Yeah, I can't char anything. Uh oh. Character stats, top left, monsters, friends. Uh, I'm gonna pull a few of you, aren't I? Oh, buddy. Get him. Get him. Boom. Ah! I don't want to face my target. He's mean. Uh, target effects. Okay. Totem. Recovering mana and health. Alright. Oh, getting some money. Lots of money. That's more money than Abenaki just gave me. Alright, what do we got over here? Click it. I click you. Come on. Oh, critical hit. Nice. Give me that. Oh. Oh, jeez. Ah! Hit him! Hit them. What is going on? Get on the other side of that fence real quick. Critical hit. Totems. Stop interrupting me. Kill him. There. Got him. I think we pulled... We pulled too many guys. That was, uh... That was frightening for a uh, level 1 Sabres. <laughs> one at a time, definitely doable. Uh, I get everything? Critical hits everywhere. What? Did you see... Don't... You didn't see me hit him. Get out of here. Oh, come on. You guys are horrible. Jeez. Look what you made me do. You're making me just kill you all. That's horrible. Let me get all your gold. I want all your monies. All your monies. Oh, level 2. Automatic level up. Gain 12 hit points. I am stronger than I was before. Kill you. Oh, you didn't see that? You got that money. Oh, there we go. Get the money. Give me the bags. Here we go. So, I'm noticing these controls are a little uh, different than what you would normally find in an MMO, but they are slightly similar. Um, it's it's not as easy to pick up these little bags, but uh, that you, you have to keep turning with the right mouse button to uh, adjust the screen and such. But that's not too bad. The uh, normal button clicking is uh, pretty good. Ah, what is that? I keep hitting something. I think I hit Q or Tab. It's probably Q for like quest. Get out of here. So you do have to hit the button often. There's like no auto attack for this. But uh, I like the uh, the animation of this. Did I get all my stuff? Is it Q? It is Q. Uh, apparently, do I, do I get them all? No, I still need to get more. Oh my gosh. Hit him. There we go. Alright. Was that it? I heard a, I heard a ding. No, I don't think I'm getting very many feathers. Getting a lot of... Oh, uh, here we go. Critical hit. Come on, hit him again, hit him again. There you go, perfect. Did you see that? You didn't see nothing. Give me some feathers. Alright, return. Okay, we got it. Alright, guys. So I'm noticing here, uh, there's no sprint, it appears. Shift and control aren't, it isn't giving me any kind of sprint. Maybe I'll get that later, I'm not sure. But I'm not getting a sprint right there. Um... The, the, the guys aren't highlighting up that well right now, but like I said, this is closed beta, so a lot of the stuff could and is subject to change. But, uh... Ah, the young magi returns. Do you have the feathers? Excellent. These will do nicely. The other components for the ritual and the totems are two potions, see invisible and cleanse. I'm expecting a shipment of silver for the cleanse. You can gather reagents for see invisible one at a time. We will need... Or dangling underground. 
I like that name. <laughs> Four dangling undergrump. It's a small, odd-looking plant. There's some in the crossroads. Extremely high concentration of nitrogen and callium. Look what all boars are. We also need six turtle brush. <laughs> the, <et> tur <laughs> the Akura turtles love to eat it. No wonder. Turtle brush, huh? Be cautious, Sabras. Of course. Voodoo practicing Imuri. Alright, let us go find some stuff. Is it, uh... Oh, so we gotta go out of the village. Alright, we can do that. We can go out of the village. Alright, do I need to talk to you to get out? Uh, are you trying to get out? Yes! Aren't you a little under-equipped? You should learn fireball and shock. Oh, oh. No. That's a good point. Good sir. Let us go and buy some other things. Because we got all that money from uh, those birds. Alright, what do I need? Fireball. Done. Uh, a hundred. Jeez Louise. Nope. Ain't got a hundred. Uh, let's see. Spellbook. Fireball. Uh, let's go back over here. I'll put you there for now. Get up on the hill. Oh, you can jump. And he's got a pretty, pretty high jump, too. What is this? Uh... How much are these? Three? Two, three. I don't know. We got a few of them. Uh, are they each individual? No? Okay, I guess it's just not going to show me. Oh, you can press E for equipment, Q for quest, or journal, or I'm guessing it's quest. We're going to call it quest for now. And here we go. Now we can go outside. We have fireball and frostbolt. Alright, yes, I'm ready to go outside. I got potions. Yeah, I want to leave. I'm good. Thank you, sir. Thank you for your concern. Crossroads. Alright, zones you just left the village. Crossroads monsters cannot follow you across the zone border. Wonderful. Alright, we are looking for some sort of moss. It grows here. Something about the wild boars. Oh, is that it there? Are these boars nice? I highly doubt they're nice. Should I kill one anyways? Oh, there we go. Uh, is this it here? I don't think that is. I think it's just flower. Crispin's glow. Is it? What? That's ridiculous. What a crazy name. Jump. Woohoo! Alright. Pander seed. Pander seed. Alright, apparently uh, you can get a bunch of these. I want to kill one of these guys real quick. Oh, wow. That's awesome. Boom. That's what I got. <laughs> Alright, oh! So it appears that uh, the fireball might have some sort of area effect because I did not target this guy and he's dead. Dangling undergrump. There we go. Got some more. There's a few of these guys over here. Yeah, it definitely got some sort of area effect. Ah! I clicked out. No! Not enough mana. What? Alright, fine, I'll just hit you. Hit him! Click, 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 click. Hit him with your staff. I definitely need some mana. Yeah, sorry about that, guys. Somehow this game clicked out for a second and it <laughs> scared the crap out of me. But, wow, this is actually pretty cool. I'm actually liking this. This is uh, very reminiscent of um, MMOs with the style of gameplay. Let's go over here. Ooh, totem. There we go. We can gain some stuff right here outside of this. So, I mean, the controls are very similar. It's very much like a mage or wizard that you will be playing. What is that? I wonder if that's one of the voodoo guys. All right, there's some undergrump. Ooh, what is this? Corrupt boar. Can we kill you? Ah, you're pretty strong. Oh, you resisted it. Oh, that was a critical. And staff. Ha <laughs> ha. Return Mada's enchanted feather to him. Oh, we got a new quest. Okay. Oh, I bet that's what that big giant boar was. Awesome. Okay. Uh, 
Uh, come on. Not enough. Ah, oh, jeez. So this whole mana thing. Get out of here. Oh, dude, I do not have any health to deal with you. And I'm pretty sure this totem's not going to do anything for me because I'm in combat. Run from the boar! No! <laughs> Run away! What is that? Did I get all the stuff I needed? Are you? Oh my gosh, you're still chasing me. Jeez, how far do I have to run? Oh, still, still in combat. Tender sea. Alright, now if I run across here, you shouldn't be able to follow me. I have no health. Okay, there we go. Alright, back in the village. Oh, actually, we're just going to take a second. Get some more health. Uh, how are we looking? Enchanted feathers. Uh, I guess that's returning. Yeah, I think we still need some undergrowth stuff. Yeah. Alright, so we're going to go grab that. And uh, then we'll get back. Where? What is that? Is that anything? No, it's nothing. Uh, spears? Will we use anything? No, spears are nothing. So the... What? Why would you do that, sir? Don't do that. Attack me for no reason. Uh, so yeah, so the game, uh, the graphics are, are pretty good. I like I like the way the, the characters look at least. Um, the levels here look a little bit sparsely. Uh, Turtle brush from Turtle Beach. All right, I don't know where that is. I guess we just got to keep going this way. So there's not much going on here in the levels. What is that? Should definitely get this. But uh. Like I said, this is, I'm just going to keep reiterating, this is closed beta, so a lot of the stuff is very much subject to change, but I'm definitely enjoying uh, what we got going on so far. Ooh, look, the beach. Nice. That is looking pretty cool over here. Turtle Beach. Now I'm looking for some type of something. Are these turtles good or bad? I don't know if they're good or bad. Ah, get around. Wait, is this something I can pick up? What is this little thing over here? What is this? Tanzanite. Okay. Alright, there's some turtle brush. Alright, so I just gotta grab some of that. And a bottle. I gotta figure out what this bottle is. You get it? No? Bottle of nothing. Akura. Alright, brittle bright. More brittle bright. Alright, so here we go. Close and interact. Turtle brush. Turtle brush. Oh, you don't like me touching that, do you? Oh, geez, there's a lot of you guys. I'm just gonna run by you. Because you hit hard. Turtle brush. Turtle brush. Uh, I think we need like one more. Ooh, some more rock over here. More tons of night. Oh, geez, you guys just follow the entire time. It's insane. Oh, sodium. It's not even ten tonight. Oh my gosh, get out. Uh, slow turtles. <laughs> ah, rock. It's stuck for a second. Uh, is this anything? Is there anything over here? Uh, here we go. This should be... That's not going to be it, is it? Yep, turtle brush. Okay. Wow, you guys are just hardcore. Just going to follow me. What are you, who are you? Maybe you have to be up early to catch the best fish. Okay. That's uh guess this point out of here. Oh, oh wow that was a hard hit. Wow. Alright, here we go. We can run like that and check them out. So I'm definitely trying to get used to these controls. They are slightly different from what I'm used to. Um But no biggie. We are still doing well as our young shaman Silvrez. I love it. I like, I like the jump. This dude's got like some sort of gymnastics. Like jump sideways, twist. Like who jumps like that? This guy's like, man, I gotta get going. But man, look at this stuff. This is definitely cool. I'm hoping you guys uh, leave me some uh, information down in the comment section below. Let me know what you think about this gameplay because uh, I'm kind of digging this stuff right here. Here we go. We're going to be running back. 
I mean, you can just see right here all the graphics. It's looking pretty good. Uh, so every time the little disc pops up, it appears we are saving. I don't know if we got that. There we go. I can kill that guy real quick and easy. I'm gonna get you too. Come here. There we go. Let's get back through here. So a lot of the stuff, if you've ever played World of Warcraft, this um, village stuff looks very similar to the troll villages that you'll find. So it's very reminiscent of that. At least in my opinion, it is. You know, if you guys don't think it is, please let me know. All right, Abenaki, I got your stuff, my man. Here you go. Ah, good. This next step requires some alchemy, a bit more advanced than what you've done before, but I think you can handle it. Go to the alchemy shop and get the Sea Invisible, and then craft two Sea Invisible potions. Oh my gosh. All right, alchemy, that's you, my friend. Speed, invisibility, Sea Invisibility. Alright, so we got that. Make. Alright, spellbook. Alchemy. Alright, there we go. We got two of them. Wonderful. Alright, do our awesome shaman jump. There we go. <laughs> Back to Abenaki. Ah, you have the potions. Good color. Excellent clarity. Very well done, Sawgrass. Well, thank you, Abenaki. I, I try hard. We actually only need one of them. But it must be pristine. We'll use this one. Here, you can keep the extra. It may come in handy someday. To see invisible? Uh, sure, I guess. Why not? A lot of invisible people around here. So, let's take a look here. We're almost ready. One last thing you can do. We're getting a lot of alchemy practice today. We need a cleanse potion. But the alchemy should be used for the reagents. It requires four silver and two Crispin's glove. There is some silver on this island, but it's found near the Emery village. They're hostile and they use voodoo. Uh oh. At the docks. I have Crispin's glove here for you. It's also scarce, so be very careful with it. Pick up the silver from the lockmaster and then find the alchemy shop. Return cleanse potion. All right. Well, that is gonna do it. I'm not gonna go run this quest errand for him, Mr. Abenaki. You're you're asking too much right now. So if you guys enjoyed this video and you like this game and the style, the, the look, the music, the, the gameplay, you know, any bit of it, let me know down in, let me know, let me know down in the comments below. I can't talk right now. I'm sorry, guys. And uh, if you did and you actually enjoy it, please tell me that in the comments. Also, find that thumbs up button for me, then click, flick, or hit it. Because it really helps out my channel. I greatly appreciate all the support you guys have been giving me. Uh, it's really nice to read your comments, see the thumbs up, and just know that you guys are enjoying these entertaining, awesome videos that I'm putting out for you. And speaking of which, if you haven't subscribed, please don't forget to subscribe for more videos just like this one. And as always, my friend, I will see you next time. Bye-bye.